Good evening. A Perth man and his wife have been sentenced to death, caught smuggling half a tonne of ice through Thailand. Tonight, Luke Cook is on death row in Bangkok as his family tries to raise money for an appeal. Telling Nine News, he was framed. Former FIFO worker Luke Cook left Balkata for Thailand over a decade ago in search of a new life. And he got it, living in luxury in Pattaya, acquiring a hotel, a restaurant, a bar, even a massage parlour. Well, it was a bit of fun for me, really. Uh, now, the father of three and his Thai wife are on death row in a Bangkok prison, found guilty of trying to smuggle more than $300 million worth of methamphetamine destined for Australian shores. Thai police say motorcycle gang Hell's Angels paid Cook 10 million US dollars to smuggle the 500 kilo haul from China and that he dumped the cargo overboard when a Navy patrol boat intercepted his yacht in international waters. But friends have reached out to Nine News proclaiming his innocence, saying Luke is a family man who loves his kids. When this first happened, he did everything he could to try and get them out of the country. He is innocent. He would never do something like this. I believe he has been set up to take the fall for someone else's mistake. Cook is also linked to the 2015 murder of high-profile Hell's Angel Wayne Schneider. Luke Cook's father, Paul Cook, has flown to Thailand to be with his son during the court battle and issued this statement to Nine News. We as a family are very disappointed with the verdict handed down on Friday. We are working with lawyers in relation to an appeal and wish to make no further comment except to say that Luke Joshua Cook is not, nor has ever been a member or associate of the Hells Angels Motorcycle Club. We can say that 100%. The Department of Foreign Affairs is providing consular assistance. Experts say it's likely Cook's death sentence will be commuted to life in prison. Jerry DeMassi, Nine News.